the A to Z guide to Bordeaux wines. Today, the letter T, as in tasting. How to taste Bordeaux wines. Hello, Elsa. Hello. We're talking about the art of tasting Bordeaux wines. Is it an art reserved solely for the initiated? No, not at all. Everyone can learn to taste wines. It requires a little practice. So what are the stages of tasting a wine? There are three stages of tasting. Sight, smell and taste. OK. So the first stage is the visual part. By bringing the glass level with your eyes, behind a light source, you'll be able to assess the colour of the wine and its intensity. Then, looking at the wine from above, you'll be able to observe the tints and the clarity of the wine. All of this information will give us an indication of the wine's age. Then we continue with the nose? Yes, in two stages. The first nose, without rotating the glass, allows us to perceive the intensity of the wine and the most volatile aromas. Next, the second nose. Here we will rotate the glass to swirl and aerate the wine. We will breathe in again and then we will be able to smell the least volatile aromas and confirm the intensity of the first nose. Third stage, we taste the wine. Assessing the wine on the palate is slightly more complicated. First of all, we sip a small quantity of wine and chew. What does chewing mean? Chewing the wine means moving it back and forth over the palate in order to assess its overall balance. While chewing the wine, we will draw in a little air, which will be breathed out by the nose. This is the phenomenon called retroolfaction, which will enable us to separate the flavours. Afterwards, we will spit out the wine and measure its length on the palate. Is the tasting technique the same for all Bordeaux wines? Absolutely. However, for red, we will assess the balance between tannins, alcohol and roundness, whereas for white wines, this balance is found between acidity and sweetness. Colour, aroma, taste. Now you know as much about Bordeaux wines as I do. 